everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I am filming the Christmas tag. I thought pretty appropriate. I am dressed pretty festive. If you guys saw my last video, I actually did a tutorial on this makeup look here. So make sure you click the box right here if, if that's what you're looking at first and you're like, first I want to know how she got that makeup done. Not that I necessarily think that you're thinking that, but just in case, it's, it's, it's linked right here. Um, so today I'm going to be filming the Christmas tag, as I said. So let's get started. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. So number one, do you like to stay in your PJs or dress up for Christmas? Me personally, it depends. Is there a Christmas party involved? Because I'm not going to a Christmas get together in my PJs. But I guess the way I want to answer this is if I don't have anywhere to go, I would obviously stay in my PJs, rock out in the PJs, have some hot chocolate, play with our toys, because you know even though my kids get toys, I like to play with them too. And just like be comfortable and cozy and warm and enjoy our gifts that we received and our time as a family together. But if I'm going to like a family dinner or whatever, as in this year, um, we're actually having our Christmas dinner on Christmas Day. So then I'm obviously going to dress up because I don't want to go in my PJs. And I do enjoy doing my makeup and dressing up. So yeah, but if I don't have to, I don't want to spend the time getting ready. I'd rather just like cuddle as a family all in our PJs and do nothing but play. If you could buy only one person a present this year, who would it be? And that would have to be... Caden because um, I feel like this is the first year that he's really really understanding Christmas I might have said that and repeated myself last year but I feel like he's he's kind of understanding Santa Claus a little bit more and all that type of thing so like I just I love seeing him open presents and I would just love to see him Mackenzie's a little too young he still doesn't well he won't remember and Corey and I just don't really exchange gifts anyways we just do really stocking stuffers so Caden would be the number one person I would want to buy for if it wasn't my children if I we weren't including my children it would probably have to be my mother because my mother has done so much for me and she has given me gifts for how many years she still does and I am 27 years old and she does not need to buy me gifts anymore but she still does so I would have to buy my mom a gift like for sure my mom because she's just so kind and sweet but if it's including my children I'd have to buy Kate. Do you open presents Christmas Eve or Christmas morning? And we personally open presents on both days. I like to give the boys a little present Christmas Eve which is like pajamas, a movie, popcorn, that type of thing. You'll see that video coming in the future I'm sure. And then we open all the rest of our gifts like our main gifts and our Santa Claus gifts obviously all on Christmas morning but Christmas Eve is kind of like our movie night so I like to give that gift Christmas Eve so we can all watch movie as a family Christmas Eve night. Have you ever built a gingerbread house? Yes we have. I'm hoping to buy a kit this year as well and film it and so you guys can see Kate and I put the gingerbread house together. I know when Corey and I first started dating uh, the very first Christmas we had together, that holidays, we built a gingerbread house together. But I don't personally know if I ever have with Caden, so this year I really want to with Caden because I think he'd have a lot of fun with it. And he'd probably eat most of it. What do you like to do on Christmas break? And personally, I just like to spend time with family. I like to travel in to see my family because my family, if you guys didn't know, lives about three hour drive away from us. So I like to make sure that we spend lots of time with them, especially with having children. I just want them to really be around my children as much as possible so that they don't miss out on anything of them growing up. So it's just family and I, obviously like if Corey gets some time off work I just like to spend it all as a family playing enjoying ourselves and just loving each other I don't know that sounds corny, but it's true favorite Christmas meal or treat I personally love Christmas dinner. I am Ukrainian. I talked about this about Thanksgiving you know that includes pierogies and halabchi and pedishke and like all that fun stuff Oh, it's so delicious. I love it, but I also love Christmas baking. I'm trying to think of like one thing I love more than anything. Oh, Oreo cheesecake balls. Maybe I'll do a recipe on those this year. I don't think I've ever done one, but it is so good. My family makes it all the time. It's these little like Oreo cheesecake truffles. Oh my God, they are so good. Guys, let me know if you want to see the recipe on that. I swear to goodness, once you try it, that you'll have to make it all the time because it's that good. What's your favorite holiday movie? I would have to 
Wednesday for our family and I really like it as well as Polar Express. I love that movie. It's one of Caden's favorites obviously. If you guys have watched me for a while you know my son is obsessed with trains. So we watch it all year round to be honest. It's one of Caden's favorites. It doesn't matter if it's Christmas or not. But we watch it all the time and it has to be one of my favorites as well because it's so cute. And I actually want to get the little bell for our tree because I think Caden would really love it. So I'm thinking of doing it myself or maybe buying it. I don't know. We'll see. Candy canes or gingerbread men? Definitely candy canes. I'm not a huge fan of gingerbread, but I love me candy canes. And candy canes come in all different flavors. So if you don't like peppermint, there's another one out there for you. So there's definitely a candy cane that everyone likes. Well, I think. Have you ever made a snowman? Yeah, I'm from Canada. There's snow all over the place. Well, actually, not this year. There's not as much snow. I'm looking out my window, but I've, I've built myself a snowman. A pretty cool snowman. Yeah. <laughs> Which do you like better, Christmas Eve or Christmas Day? Definitely Christmas Day. I get so excited for the kids. Like, I'm so excited for him to, like, experience Santa Claus and the stockings and just see his face light up. And just, like, even mine as a child, that was just obviously the best day ever. And I still consider it the best day. Way better than Christmas Eve. I don't know. <laughs> white lights or colored lights. You know what? Before, I probably would have said white. White, white, white. I love the look of white lights on a Christmas tree. But Cory was really against it. So when we bought our Christmas tree, we got one that flips back and forth from colored to white. And then I saw the colored on the tree and I was like, wow, that looks really good too. So be honest, I'm so on the fence about it. So right now we have our light, our Christmas tree flicking from white to colored. To white to color because it has a setting because I'm like I can't decide I just don't know they both look so pretty in their own way it makes a tree look really different like really different depending on what lights you put so yeah but anyways that is all for this video I gotta go I can hear my baby hollering he's like mama come pick me up I don't like this swing anymore come get so, me so yeah if you like this video please give it a big thumbs up and let me know you're supporting me doing my version of vlogmas and you are enjoying it if you aren't already please subscribe subscribe by clicking the button in the top corner right over there or in the down bar down below well not the down bar but below this video um also make sure you check out yesterday's video which i said was on this makeup look right here and other than that i'm trying to be quick because my kid is crying i love you guys to the moon and back and I will see you in my next video. Mwah. Bye! Video off, I have my foundation done and my eyebrows and we are going to move on and start on the eyes. To start off this makeup look, I'm just going to apply a base and the base that I love and use all the time is Max Paint Pot in Soft Ochre. So yeah, just going to put that all over my eyelid and then blend it out with my finger. So the first color we're going to be applying to our eyes is Makeup Geek.